Hey, I think it's on UHD, but uh, this is my this is my hat, my Rocky Amadeus hat. I got this from um, from Vistaprint. Vistaprint helped me make this make this hat. I'm gonna buy some more just like it. Let's see, where I work, I wear this hat in pride, and and that's my site up there. Uh, there it represents it. It's called Rock Me Amadeus with the dot US in the end. So if you can remember the, the name of the song Rock Me Amadeus by Falco, which was really popular in the 80s. And I'm in my, I'm almost 50. I'll be 50 tomorrow. This is the day before my birthday. I'll turn 50 tomorrow. And uh, Rock Me Amadeus, I think, came out in 88. So when I was 18, yeah, that's practically 32 years ago you know actually it was more than that it's so that I wouldn't be surprised if a lot of people don't know this song but if you're a child of the 80s you surely can remember Rocky Amadeus and that's really the only the people that I'm really targeting with my website pretty much is that and maybe anybody else that might be interested in so this is my website and my hat coming at you in 3D which is kind of the worst thing you can do with a VR 180 camera is take advantage of the fact that you've got a hold of somebody's head right now and they're and 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 this is very disorienting and dizzying and yucky video. So I won't do it anymore. And so I'll I'll uh, so put take off your VR, head, VR headset and I'll I'll anchor this thing back onto the to the tripod. This is this is one of the reasons why Hollywood will probably never use VR 180 is because it doesn't make sense to move the camera at all. Um, you don't want to move the camera. You don't want to use the telephoto. Um, people are still experimenting with the format. It is really not good with a VR camera to ever move it because when you're moving a VR camera, you're moving the audience. And the audience, I mean, if you could, if you had a hold of the seats of everybody in the theater, and you were a giant, and you had control of the theater, that's essentially what you're doing when you move a camera. So it's good. You can do a lot of really crazy things with a VR camera, but moving it, not unless you're really attuned to watching through VR format, is not good. Um, which is probably the reason why journalists will probably never use it, but um, it may take time. It may involve trying to do stabilization and some other, a number of other things to the video in order to make it more palatable to the general population. But uh, as of current, it's just really experimentation and, and the VR con, you know, but I'm all for it says the camera is too hot and may soon stop functioning so i can't really do much more but i think that'll be a i think that'll in the video